Don't let children watch this. I can't talk to the girls. The girls move too fast. They sure are pretty in Liberty City, though. Pretty girls in Liberty City, but they're moving. Fucking, you, you gotta, you're like an auctioneer. To, excuse me, man. <laughs> Hi, how you? Excuse me, do you have a husband? Excuse, Hi, I'm new to Liberty. They're gone. Gone. It's moving so fucking fast. It's ridiculous. And that's Baker Production. What is up, Fart Faces? Welcome to another Grand Theft Auto 4 episode. Uh, fucking Michelle and Mallory, both blowing up my phone. Hey, what the fuck do you want? Yeah? Who are you? Can you remind me? That doesn't matter. Yeah. You need to meet me outside the United Liberty Paper Building in Algonquin. It is very important that you be there. Goodbye. Fuck you. You're not my boss. And... Mallory. What, Mallory? Hey, this is Mallory. Leave me a message and I'll hit you back. <sighs> Let me guess. Your friend kept calling you to call me. And I still didn't want to talk to you. Anyway, I need to find out what's next. May not be Michelle. What the fuck, Mallory? Nico, I'm getting worried. Roman didn't get back at all last night. He likes to party. He stays out late the whole time. You know what he's like. Not on my watch, he don't. Something ain't right. Okay. So. I'm supposed to do the question mark next. But which one? This one has been on my map for a long time. This one just popped up. So... I have no idea. Let's go see what this one is, since it's the one that's been here for fucking ever. For 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 fucking ever. For 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 for. Oh my God! Yes, Playboy. It was. Too bad. Okay, fucking ran out here to this whatever. Call and collect. This is the correct question mark, I guess. Followed? Hey, strange seeing you here, Officer McGreary. I told you to come here, fucking maggot. You did? Why? I know about you. No, why? I know enough, boy. Oh. What do you know, boy? I know you killed Mikhail Faustin. I know a group of Russians want you dead. I know you ain't no saint, boy. I don't know what you're talking about, Chief. <laughs> you think this is a town that can keep a secret? I really don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, you do. You know that a man's gotta do what a man's gotta do. That people ain't perfect, that life is a mess. Sure, everybody knows that. So, you look out for me, and I don't look out for you. <laughs> know what I mean? I think so. So there's a guy trying to blackmail me. Who? I don't know. Thinks he's getting paid, though. The guy's smart. He arranged to do the exchange by the Humboldt River off Silicon Street. Said to call him from the viewpoint there. Okay. Listen, I did what I did. <laughs> I made a mistake. That don't make me the devil. Now, obviously, I can't go, because then he gets a picture of me giving him money, and I'm admitting guilt. I ain't guilty of nothing other than being a man. To be honest, I don't really care one way or another. Well, I'm a good man. No doubt. Now, call me when you get to the spot. <laughs> and the buoys in the background are going fucking nuts! <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> And again, someone moved my car. Now it's over here. Still smoking, though. Excuse me, everybody. Dude, stay in your car so I can drive away without hitting you. 
well. Let's hope I don't have to run and use this car, because it's fucking smoking! I like that the Lord Darling. I'm in the park. Now what? Alright, this guy told me to bring the money there and call him. That means he's somewhere close and he's got a phone. I'm gonna text you his number. You've got to call him and keep a lookout for someone answering a phone. You won't be far. Mm-hmm. Then you want me to murder him? You want me to murder him? about your exchange with McCreary. Yeah? You better have my paper. I ain't fucking around. I'm sure he's got your money. Have you got the stuff he wants? Yeah, I got it. We're gonna make this shit happen. the guy with the yellow I don't mess around, you know. Push me, and this shit is all over Weasel News. I got them on speed dial. Really? Yeah, and there's a lawyer called Tom Goldberg who's real interested. He's hungry for McCreary's blood and shit. Yeah. Good thing Francis is paying, then. Call me when this exchange is going down. I don't like all the talking. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's him. He just fucking walked away as I was hanging up. Oh. Hurry up. 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 Got it. Okay. Pop the, do you want to buy a hot dog? No, I don't want to buy a hot dog. I do want to get the fuck out of here, though. Look at all those cops. Holy shit! No, 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 no. Need a car. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Get in there. Hurry up and 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 there. Hurry up and there. Oh, shit. Of course. What? I'm behind the garbage. You can't see me! Me. Okay. Take the photographs on the storage drive to Forensis. Here. He's dead. Great. I can get rid of these now. I feel like a new man. Not many people get a second chance like this. It's my redemption. Your sins are absolved, I guess. Yeah. You can move on with your life with feeling no guilt that I just murdered someone on your behalf. This is not where my car was. What the fuck? So when I park it in the road... Yes, Playboy. Nico! Shit is getting fucked up. I need to see you with my crib. How did the big real estate deal go? That cat ain't got no vision. Yeah, it won't be now. Yeah, I just found out that that was not the correct question mark. But it is in like a couple of steps, so whatever. Text message from Francis. Meet me at the station. There we go. Though it might be nice... For you to see the place from the good guy's side of the bars. Why would I want to go to the station? Fuck you. Oh my god, this phone, dude! Nico, what? You and me did some work for Elizabeth Torres together? You mean I saved your ass? Well, if I'd have known it was such a big deal to you, I would have asked you to let them kill me. Anyway, if you're in need of extra funds, I'm in need of a good man. Come over to Mama's on Savannah Avenue in Meadows Park. I'm always in need of money. See you there. The fuck you want, Michelle? Look, Wrong is right. I'm not in the business of caring about people's feelings, bud. Yeah? Boo fucking who? Hey. Hi. 
Listen, I know what you must be thinking, but don't bother. I'm sorry, but I don't see how you know what I must be thinking. You've killed people. You should be dead yourself. Or inside. You're just lucky it was me and not someone else who got their hooks into you. I'm sorry that I lied to you. And, and weirdly, in some ways, you're a nice guy. Better than the creeps I normally date. But you're damaged goods. No doubt. Let's go. In here. Salute! Eat my ass, buddy. I'm up for the promotion, and you're not. What the hell are we doing here? We're going to meet someone. Sounds fun. You know, you and your cousin, you should get out. What you're looking for, you won't find. Feds are all over it. Crime is done. You've watched too many movies. Whatever you say, Michelle. Or whatever your name is. It's Karen. My name is Karen. Interesting. And you whore for the government. I kind of like the honesty in that. I have a clear conscience. How very lucky for you. <sighs> in here, Office 396. Hi there. Here he is. I can see that. Thanks, Karen. Hey, cheer up. You did good. You'll get a Sammy, if you care about that sort of thing. Thank you. So, Mr. Bellic, quite a file, quite a story. Who are you? If I be? If I be? Do I look homosexual? Do you think I care about the size of your Johnson? Now, you can't always tell who the good guys are. I'm not a good guy, but I'm fighting with them. And guess what? So are you. Hooray. That's the spirit. Nothing like a bit of sarcasm when someone's got you by the balls. Now, I need you to find something out for me. Find out everything you can about a man called Oleg Minkoff. He lives on Iroquois, back in Hove Beach. And if I say no? I hand your file over to those cretins in the FIB, and organized crime has dealt another serious blow. Go to his house. Any problems, call this number. Hmm. I'm not scared of the FIB. What's your name? Not relevant. Call me. Very soon. Oh, and hey, welcome to America, Pascala Staradejeva. Bushka. Some the bitch. U L paper. Oh, yes, yeah, someone took my fucking car again. That was a good car. Wait. There it is. Flipped out again for no reason. I'm clearly. I will. Mm, you're lucky, bitch. Mr. Minkov, anybody here? What have you got for me? Not much. He keeps a clean house, he's got a computer. Check his emails. Call back with any information that would indicate his current whereabouts. All right. Is that a jewelry shop, maybe? Okay. Get out. Get out. Out. Get it. So now what? 
There's an email that says he's meeting someone at Tulsa Street in Hove Beach. Perfect. I'll send someone to pick up the hard drive. You go to Tulsa Street. Eliminate Minkoff. Whoa. Killing is very different from gathering information. You are acting in the interest of your new countrymen and keeping yourself out of prison. For once, this is a murder you don't have to feel confused about. Dispose of Minkoff, then call me. Kill someone again. Check. Олег, ты испугал меня. Я даже подумал, что это человек. Все, он меня дожидался. Пока, братан. set up for me to not be able to catch him yet. Oh shit, he's on fire! <laughs> nice. And his car is on fire. Minkoff is dead. The country is safe. Not by a long shot, smart ass. Nothing is safe. No one is safe. Maybe something has been averted. Maybe delayed. I'll be in touch. Goodbye. Bye bye. Alright guys, well that's going to bring us to the end of another episode. I'd like to thank you so much for watching, and I will catch you next time. Peace!